Item Number SCP-2146 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-2146 is presently commonly known as DDU-SAT-12 and is on record as a defunct communications satellite owned by Defense Design United, a holding of Standard Communications Production, a Foundation front company. This information was falsified and entered into the UN Register of Objects Launched into Space by embedded agents. It is believed that the registration will discourage close scrutiny. Due to its size and location, recovery or containment is presently thought infeasible. While the Foundation possesses assets capable of reaching the object and subsequently constructing a containment structure or destabilizing its orbit, any such attempt would be too difficult to conceal. MTF Mu-19 the Starstruck have been covertly inserted into various astronomical societies in order to identify any potential breaches of the anomaly. Individuals who discover SCP-2146 are to be either administered Class B amnestics or discredited, as is appropriate for the situation. The transmissions known as SCP-2146-1 are presently impossible to suppress. However, as the content of said transmission is typically profoundly innocuous, it is considered a low-level threat. The signal has been shown to switch frequencies in early attempts to jam the signal. Its methods of detecting the jamming is presently unknown. Full jamming of the range of frequencies SCP-2146-1 broadcast on would have disastrous effects on civilian telecommunications. The transmissions are to be monitored, and these procedures may be modified if the transmissions ever begin to exhibit anomalous or otherwise dangerous properties or content. Complaints to government organizations responsible for telecommunications regulations are to be monitored. The present cover story regarding SCP-2146-1 is that it is a pirate radio station broadcast by avant-garde art movement. SCP-2146 is a frozen corpse of an adult specimen of Balona mysticetus, the bowhead whale, which is presently in medium Earth orbit. Its orbital path is circular with an inclination of 146 degrees retrograde, and its orbital period is 19.6 hours. The object is approximately 17.5 meters in length, and while its gender is presently unknown, it is, due to its size, statistically more likely to be a female instance of the species. Its estimated weight is approximately 30 tons, one-third that of a healthy specimen of its species, due to desiccation. In addition, the object has suffered significant corrosion from micro-impacts, and is deeply cracked in a manner consistent with limited heat exchanges and radiation exposure typical in a vacuum environment. Once every synodic lunar month SCP-2146 begins broadcasting radio signals, presently designated SCP-2146-1. These broadcasts range in duration from 2.5 to 18 minutes. It is presently unknown how SCP-2146 transmits these broadcasts. Telescopic viewing has not shown any sign of radio-capable equipment on SCP-2146. These broadcasts vary widely. These broadcasts vary widely in both content and format. Some appear to be documentaries. Others appear to be science fiction dramas, often of the space opera variety. Others seem to be children's shows, and others are songs or poems. These broadcasts only feature an audio track, and in every case, features an entity presently referred to as SCP-2146-2, who narrates, acts in, or sings the contents of SCP-2146-1. No other voices have yet been heard in SCP-2146-1 transmissions. The SCP-2146-1 transmissions often feature unusual and occasionally disturbing content. However, SCP-2146-2 is always cheerful to the point of jocularity in the broadcast. Its voice seems to be that of a middle-aged deep-voiced man, and has been known to speak a number of languages, including English, French, Norwegian, Russian, and Inuktitut. SCP-2146-1 transmissions contain one other unifying feature. In every case, the contents deal with a space well, a space-based cetacean. However, the features, motivations, and characterization of this creature changes with each broadcast. 
No information as to how SCP-2146 came to be located in Earth orbit has yet come to light. No launches involving bowhead whales or of a size capable of transporting an intact bowhead whale are presently known to the Foundation. Discovery SCP-2146 was discovered in 19 after a number of civilian complaints in several developed nations in the Northern Hemisphere were linked by Foundation analytical personnel. These complaints were generally directed towards government offices that regulated telecommunications, and always involved bizarre and disturbing radio show content. The signal, later designated SCP-2141-1, was used to triangulate the location of its source, SCP-2146. Fortunately, developing telecommunications and a subsequent increase in both radio traffic and artificial orbital bodies have rendered SCP-2146 and its transmissions much more difficult to isolate. See above for the present containment procedures. A list of notable SCP-2146-1 broadcasts. Broadcast Date 19 Duration 2 minutes and 56 seconds Language English Content A short jingle SCP-2146-2 singing, apparently accompanied by guitar, apparently for a children's show featuring Babo the Space Whale. Notable lyrics include, He loves you so much, he's gonna eat your whole world up. You get to learn all about science in Babo's guts. And swims through space, the size of a star. He's the friendliest, nicest cosmic monster. Broadcast Date 19 Duration 8 minutes and 14 seconds Language French Content A short political manifesto laying out the rights of exocitations and making a number of derogatory claims regarding oppressive higher dimensional harpoonists. Notable content includes the exocitation's inalienable right to devour lesser races. Broadcast date 2000 and Duration 16 minutes and 3 seconds. Language English Content a melodramatic science fiction production of the space opera variety, including orchestral scoring, not a match for any known piece. Regards the quest of the brave space whale Owaba to defeat the evil empire and rescue space whale princess Bawuha. Notable in that the evil empire seems to consist of beings in spacecraft, possibly humanoid. Broadcast date 20 Duration 12 minutes and 51 seconds Language Norwegian Content A documentary regarding the feeding and mating practices of Balana stellaris, the space whale. Notable in that the species is, by its binomial nomenclature, identified as a right whale, like SCP-2146, as a bowhead whale. Also, the reproduction of a Balana stellaris apparently requires the utter destruction of a primitive civilization. The reason behind its reproductive necessity is not made clear. Broadcast Date 20 Duration 6 minutes and 47 seconds Language Russian Content A short science fiction tale about a crew of apparently human biologists in a spacecraft, attempting to locate a legendary creature, the space whale. Most of the story consists of the scientists' speculation on the nature of the space whale in a pseudo-scientific and mildly religious manner. The story ends with the crew finding the space whale and, in awe, pledging to worship it. Broadcast Date 20 Duration 8 minutes and 22 seconds Language English Content An episode of the children's show Baybo to Space Whale which was featured in an earlier broadcast of SCP-2146-1 as a jingle. It involves a number of children in a spacecraft speaking through a communicator with the nearby Baybo, a star-sized cetacean. The episode consists of a simplified explanation of gravity, appropriate for 8-10 year old children. The episode ends with the spacecraft crashing into Baybo, and the narrator stating, And the children all died. They should have paid more attention to the lesson, I guess.